London's iconic black cabs are more than just a ride. They're a symbol of the city. But did you know these drivers, famous for their knowledge of London streets, are now helping scientists improve AI? Turns out, their incredible route planning skills could hold the key to smarter navigation technology and even Alzheimer's research. Here's more. London's famous black taxis are more than just a ride. They are the capital's icon. No London scene is complete without the silhouette of a black cab. Meet Mark Manning, a London-based taxi driver. For Manning, driving a taxi in London is more than just a job. It's a skill that has taken him years to master. I love my job, 25 years, and I still love it. Uh, very proud of it. Very proud of the fact that, you know, I'm one of a, a very small number that can actually do the knowledge. There are plenty of people that probably start the knowledge, but just can't do it for whatever reason. Unlike app-based navigation systems, London's taxi drivers don't rely on sat-navs. Instead, they rely on years of training and experience to plan the best possible routes in real time. Each driver must pass a rigorous exam known as the knowledge, memorizing over 26,000 streets to navigate the city efficiently. Someone gets into the taxi, for example, they want to go somewhere, and we've got a straight away, we know which way we're going to go. We know what direction we're heading in. But we may come across an accident, roadworks, something going on where we have to instantly change where we're going to, do, where we're going to go, which routes we're going to take. I'm sure computers can do that. But when it comes to things like sat-navs, we've proven it time and time again. We will be a sat-nav, hands down. And now, in an interesting turn of events, scientists are studying how this expertise in route planning could help them improve AI technology. Wondering how? Well, researchers believe their unique approach to route planning could inform the development of artificial intelligence and further research into Alzheimer's disease. So obviously sat-navs are amazingly good. You know, Google Maps will very much tell me where I need to go as an example. Um, but how that relates to the way humans plan and the best possible humans is a little bit unknown. And, you know, humans, taxi drivers, can plan all these amazing things after eating a banana. Their brains can run super efficiently at that. Whereas AI takes a lot of resources to do the same. So there may be some tricks and efficiencies we can learn from London taxi drivers that can build better AIs, but also better AIs that integrate with human mistakes and planning. So that's going to help bring these two together. Researchers are using high-resolution MRI scans to examine the medial temporal lobe of London taxi drivers, focusing on the hippocampus, the brain's navigation and memory center. Past studies have shown that the hippocampus grows larger with experience in these drivers. Through this study, scientists are hoping to learn exactly which part of the brain is responsible for these changes. So the interesting thing about London taxi drivers is they spend two to four years training to master their knowledge of 26,000 streets and they carry on working with this knowledge. And what scientists have found is that the longer they've been working, the larger the posterior hippocampus becomes. The hippocampus is the key bit of your brain for memory and spatial memory. And so they get bigger, but unfortunately in Alzheimer's disease, that bit of the brain actually is one of the first to start getting smaller and smaller. So it may be that the kind of skills these taxi drivers build offset them against Alzheimer's disease. And there's been some recent evidence to suggest that might be the case. But it's an ongoing active line of research because if we can learn from the taxi drivers how they do this, we might be able to find ways to improve people's brain function and avoid the burden of Alzheimer's disease in the future. Researchers believe AI systems might be able to learn from these human experts, proving to be an essential part for the development of a much smarter and more efficient navigation technology. For now though, it seems London's cabbies are in the driver's seat for choosing the best route. <laughs>